and Dan Savage, OrlandoMagic.com. Kareem, congrats on the championship, by the way. And if you could just kind of take us through what that experience was like, uh, you know, going through the, the, the playoff and championship run. Um, it was great. It was great. You know, our team, we really bonded together. We came, came, came together when we didn't need, needed it the most. And uh, it, I think it really showed on the defensive end. I think our defense was always good from uh, as soon as the season started, but it often picked up at the right time. And uh, we, ju we just had fun. We had a good, good group of guys. Everybody was f feeling good about everything that we were doing in the bubble. And uh, we really, like I said, we really bonded together and that showed on the court. Josh Robbins, The Athletic. Kareem, can you describe what kind of learning experience it was for you to play as many minutes as you did? Uh, it was big. It was big, really big. Got got me a, got me feeling more comfortable out there on the, on the floor. Got me learning a lot on and off the court, especially starting from the the general managers to the assistant coaches. You know, just talking to them about everything about the game and just how to be a pro. I just learned a whole lot on and off the court. So it was it was very big for me. And like you said, playing those kind of minutes and just getting experience, getting out there, getting comfortable, and just playing through mistakes and learning every single game, man. I think I got better every single game, man. Yeah. What are, I know it's tough to measure uh, something in such a short period of time. I mean, it's just like yesterday you guys won the title, but uh, what areas are you better at now? I think the game slowed down a whole lot for me. Like I said, I think the first interview I did and I, and I spoke to you guys, I was saying that it was going a lot faster, but now it, it really slowed down. Everything's just much smoother. I'm more comfortable with the, the sets of plays that we have in, uh, in our Orlando Magic uh, organization. So just everything slowed down, obviously, and just decision making and seeing the floor more, everything like in, in that in that area just improved a lot in that month during the, in the bubble. Back to Dan Savage. Kareem, we, we've, we've seen uh, Stan Heath have tr tremendous success since uh, taking over the head coaching role for the Lakeland Magic. What is it like to play for him, and, and, and how is he as a head coach? Uh, he kind of just said an extension of Clifford, Coach Cliff here, so it was pretty pretty much easy, and uh, he's, uh, he's kind of like, I, I, just like I said, just like Cliff, so he kind of strict. If, if he wants something done, he wants to get, get it done the, the way he wants it, so He's not. He's not gonna really gonna mess around, and that's something that I think every everybody kind of benefited on 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 the Lakeland Magic team, and that really got us to know. You know, yes, we can have fun with each other, but when it's time to go, we, we it was time to go. So we're focused and just executed the game plan every single day. Christos Saltis, fourteen degrees. Hello, Karim. Congratulations on the success with uh, Lakeland Magic in the bubble. I would like to ask you. How big boost you get from your uh, from your performances in the bubble with Lakeland Magic and your success in with uh, with the team and also what is your mindset about the rest of the season with uh, the Orlando Magic? Um, sorry, I didn't hear the first question. But, how uh, big boost you get from your success with uh, Lakeland Magic? How, how much was sorry? How big boost? Oh, my, uh, yeah, yeah. Um. My mindset going forward is really just, like I said, I'm, I feel more comfortable out here. So just trying to find a way to benefit the team over here to help us win as much as I can, you know, be being active on the defensive end of the floor and just making the game easier for everybody on the offensive end of the floor. So that's kind of my mindset going forward with the for the rest of the season here with the Magic. So, yeah. And what was your second question, Star? How big boost you get from your success with uh, the Lakeland Magic in the bubble? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, just us winning, I think, give a lot, whole lot of boost to everybody that was on the team. You know, a lot of confidence, especially for me coming in, knowing that now I can, I can, I can really perform at this level, and I kind of know my identity, and I kind of know what I, what I need to do going forward in order to get better, and in order to um, fit in the team, whatever team I'm, um, I'm, I'm put in, so or whatever situation I'm put in. So, I kind of benefited in that way, but definitely confidence wise, and uh, just being more comfortable out there on the floor. All right. Thank you for your time, Kareem. Uh, thank you.